everything the audience hear within the audience everything they hear is live there isn't any backing tracks and a lot of the west end shows actually do rely heavily on backing tracks whereas here at thursford we we, we pride ourselves on having a 100 percent live show so whoever's in the audience when they see something and they hear it it's a fully fully live show There are loads of us, but yeah, everyone works really well as a team. I think each head of department really brings everyone together as well. And we do really fun things in the rehearsal period, like um, full company warm up and things where we have a real laugh. So we get to know each other better. So yeah, everyone works really well together. I've always wanted to do um, Irish dancing. So I've trained mostly in ballet. Um, so that's something completely different for me. So I really loved the challenge of learning the Irish, um, but I do also love the Christmas finale. It's just Christmas overload, but it's amazing. <laughs> very nature of the show itself is very complex and consequently the audio system is very complex. We have 70 channels of radio mics in this show which is a very high number. Generally the shows in the West End and other big Christmas shows or, or any show throughout the year really they would have numbers of radio mics maybe 20, 30 radio mics so to have 70 allows us and it allows the choreography team to create a very dynamic show. With the orchestra, if you can walk on stage carrying your instrument, we put a microphone on you. And that allows, as I said, the choreography team to... She can put an oboe player on that side of the stage, or she can put something on the other side of the stage. The stage is 140 feet wide. There's, there's, I think there's nearly 70 pieces of music in this year's show. Um, I just sit by myself day in and day out, and I press CDs and formulate the programme, always based on the music first and the ideas second. That goes on from February, March, April. Uh, I have to have the programme finished by uh, mid-May. But then I call in the choreographers, the writers and everybody, and we go over my ideas for about a week. And uh, they, get, they get options sometimes. I said, do you prefer that or that or this? But mostly um, it's as I've, you know, I've done. 